Hi Year 3, it's Miss Hill again. So we're going to look at a second example. So just like I said in the last video, you need to make sure when you're subtracting the biggest number goes first. And when you're placing your calculation um, into a written method, you need to place it into columns. So you've got all your ones together, all your tens together and all your hundreds together. You also need to make sure that you um, put the subtraction symbol over here to say that you are subtracting and not adding. And also, um, I forgot to say in the last video is when you're looking at the ones column and you don't have enough ones to subtract, okay, please do not switch those two numbers around so you can subtract them. So don't do um, seven subtract two, okay? Because you'll then change the question. So I'm gonna show you again using my place value counters. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, 142, okay? And I'm subtracting 237. Okay, I'm going to draw a line underneath here. Okay, so I can't subtract seven away from two. So what I need to do is I need to regroup, okay, and exchange one of these tens for 10 ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I had two ones and now I've got 10 more. So now I can subtract seven away from 12, okay, because two and 10 makes 12. So I have now 12 ones and I can subtract seven. So I need to say, need to put a one there to say that I've um, uh, exchanged one of these tens for 10 ones. So I now have three tens and I have 10 ones. Okay, so now I have 12, subtract seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So I now have five ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now you can see that I'm left with five ones. Okay. Now I have three tens and I need to subtract three tens. One, two, three, they're all gone. So I need to say I have zero tens left. Okay, then I had 500 and I need to subtract 200. Can you see then I'm left with 300? So the answer to the question is 305. Now I'm gonna show you the written method again. So I can't subtract seven away from two. So what I need to do is I need to exchange 110 for 10 ones. So I'm gonna say I've now got three tens because I've got one less 10 and I'm going to ha add my 10 ones to my two ones, and now I've got 12 ones, so I can subtract seven from my 12, okay, which is five. And if you're unsure, please count on your fingers or use resources. Now I've got to do 30 subtract 30, okay, so three tens subtract three tens, I have no tens left, okay, because I had three, and now I've just taken them away. Then I'm left with 500 subtract 200, so five subtract two, I'm left with three. So as you can see, I've got the same answer, so 305. So just like my place value chart, I have 305. I also have 305 in my written method. Okay, so just make sure that um, you're exchanging today. So you're gonna be exchanging a 10 for 10 ones in all of your questions. I hope that makes sense. Take care, see you later, bye.